if you want to do a professional business, then you don't want to use a free account like Gmail or Yahoo. So to look professional in your business, you will need to get an email address coming from your domain name. Hello guys, this is Swadik here at Digo Pages Web, where I do web tutorials just like this one. So if you are new here, consider subscribing. That said, let's jump into the video. So to look professional in your business, you will need to get an email address coming from your domain name. You can easily do that by scrolling down under email accounts. You click on add new or you can come to the side panel. Then you hover on the first icon right here. Next, you go over to email manager. Then you go ahead and click on email accounts to take you to where you can do the creation. Apart from these two, you can also go to the search bar right here and search for email. And it will give you the same option right here. So I go ahead and click on email accounts. If you already have some email addresses created, this is where you will see them. And if you want to create a new one, you click on create account under actions. I click on create account. In the first field, that is username, I enter the name I want to use for my email. So this is where you want to create an email address like info at your domain name.com, enquiries at your domain name.com, or you can even use your own name at your domain name.com. For this, I'm just going to go ahead and enter agency. And you don't need to add the at your domain name.com because you already have it right here. If you are finding value so far, please give this video a thumbs up. It does help me out so that the video will be suggested to more people on YouTube and also benefit more people. All right, let's continue. Next, you choose a custom password for your email. You can also go ahead and generate it by clicking on this icon right here. If I click on generate, you see that I have the password there. In order to view it, you can click on the eye icon right here. I'm just going to go ahead and enter in my own custom password. Next is email quota. You can set whatever number of megabytes you want. By default, it is set to 50 megabytes. You can also go ahead and use the highest by selecting maximum. For this, I'll just enter 100 megabytes. And I'll go ahead and click on create account. And my account is created right here. And the first one is the email address followed by the password. I've hidden mine for obvious reasons. And finally, we have the IMAP server and then the SMTP server. With these two details, you can use it to connect your email address to perhaps your Google account so that your server will be free from emails. I will leave a video link in the description down below that will show you how you can link your email address to your Gmail account. So you can go ahead and watch that video after you have finished watching this tutorial. I exit out of here and now you see that I have my email address right here. In order to check your email address, you can just go ahead and click on this arrow right here and it will open in a new tab and take you to your webmail. As you can see, my email list is empty. I don't have any messages. This interface is just similar to any email service provider out there. I exit out of here and I can go back to the dashboard. So that's it on how you can create a professional email address for your business. All right, guys, I hope you found value in today's video. If you did, kindly hit the like button subscribe if you have not yet subscribed and also hit the notification bell so that each time i post a new video on this channel you will be the first to know keep watching and i will see you in the next one